I think the state has a vested interest in pulling apart families and and weakening oh, yeah. our social ties oh, because yeah. that makes them oh, yeah. the people that you go to when you need help rather than having a stable structure, a, f- a stable family structure that can support you when things happen. If you don't have that, then the state is what you rely they- on. Hate the family structure. This is Marxism. I mean, so many. We talked about Friedrich Engels last week. He wrote a book about mm-hmm. how feminism is needed, not because women um, have any biological differences between men, not because of any of the, the, the societal differences between male and female. It's the nuclear family. That's the problem. That's why women are oppressed. That's what we need to get rid of. And this is a clear. I mean, he was an open Marxist. This is a Marxist school of yeah. thought that the government should step in where family fails to meet right. the government's standards and 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 it's evil it's wrong and i think that they mm-hmm. they know that the major that the, the more families they split up the more fathers are not in the home the more likely mm-hmm. that these people are going to grow up and vote for more government control cuz now they need more help they need more welfare they need more social programs and you see how the state just ever and ever expands and now we're seeing a crazy phenomenon. I think it started over COVID, but a little bit before that possibly, where parents were shamed and told, you don't know better. The teachers unions know better. The teachers, the educators hired by the state, the, your kids belong to them, yeah. essentially. I think so they it, showed their yeah. hand a little they showed too much. Their, yo, a lot of COVID. people are starting to Not wake up to lie. it. Yep. Yeah, no. I, <sighs> Olivia, the amount of moms that came out of the woodwork from COVID who are now yep. like radical um for freedom is just it's like the amazing. random soccer moms or like the the yeah. like libertarian activists now i actually love now. it i actually I do love too. it i do too <laughs> i'm like okay this is finally where we see like women say no i'm not doing this i think a gr- the best way the state could disintegrate the family unit is by attacking men and their ambitions and their desire to have a family um and create wealth for them and create that stable structure like this is a really great way if if you're the government and you want to gain yeah. more power one of the best ways you can do it is is by attacking masculinity and making men feel insecure about their futures a lot of- 